What's up guys, it's the next Mike Ike and I'm coming back at you with another Valheim video. <coughs> or Valheim, however you want to pronounce it. And uh, we're just going to continue right where we left off last time. Haven't played since then, so we're just going to keep chugging along. Hoping to get a couple more deer killed and then we're also going to go... Let's see if we can get this guy real quick. Totally missed. And totally missed. Alright, we're gonna get some... Ooh, I'm on fire. Don't step on the fire, guys. We're gonna get some more food, some diversity of food cooked up so we can keep our bar now that we've discovered that that's actually something important. Let's grab some wood from this chest. Build up some wooden arrows. There we go. I'm gonna need to get some more flint here soon. So we'll run around here. I know we usually get some deer spawn in here, so. Maybe we'll get lucky and get a deer to spawn up in here. Got one. Oh, here we got, got a couple. Oh, don't do that. Alright, got that one. that one. Got that one. Got it. Nice. Perfect. We got deer trophy there. Nice. Okay. Okay. Get him kill pretty easy. We want to come down here and I want to kill some of those uh, little, well, like newt things. some of those so we can get some of their tail because that was something else that we could eat and there seemed to have been a bunch of them but they all seem to be out in the water somewhere I wonder if you could fish in this game it seemed odd with all this water to not be able to fish so hopefully fishing is a thing in this game Hopefully it's actually fun. Alright, there's there's a couple of those little guys over here. over here. Oh, there's three over here. See if we can... <laughs> See, it looks like there's there's a fish in there or something. That one. Okay. 
don't know where the other ones got off to. We did get that one up. Missed. What on earth? How did we miss that? Not the best here with our shots. Okay, where, where did I peg that guy? It's over here somewhere. Oh, we can pick those back up. That's nice. trying to figure out how to get like a uh, a stone like pick I feel like pick is something we're like definitely missing I don't know there's so in this game there doesn't seem to be like a level restriction it kind of seems like when you build this you unlock this or when you kill this you unlock this so um, obviously that's something we've got to figure out broken up. Could also shoot for a pickaxe here, guys. Looks like those things are back. Oh, maybe not. Yes. There they are. Let's see if we can We got one of them. The other one ran away. Yeah, because like picking one rock up at a time is it's not really cutting it. Getting close to nighttime, so we're gonna want to start looking at no, not a deer. Thought there was another deer there. Oh, there is another deer there. Alright, let's chop this up first. Hopefully not scare that thing. Nope. for me.
Hopefully later on in the game you unlock like a bigger thing or something that like cooks it but then also stores it. Cause you don't want to sit here and babysit this stuff the whole time. I do like the fact that you can sleep through the night, because a lot of times, like, the nighttime card of the games, these games can kind of be boring. It just gets harder to see, you know, and yeah, it adds a little suspense, but really most of the time it's just, like, a hassle just, just to be a hassle, right? And, you know, that kind of sucks. So the fact that you can sleep through most of the night is nice in this game. Beautiful pixelated leaves we got there. <laughs> yeah, boring, just sitting here watching food cook. I don't want to miss it when it's cooked. That's the problem. Because you do that and then. Then it gets burnt, turns into charcoal. Which, like I said, I'm sure that has a use. Dang, already down to 20 of those. Got some of this. What else we got here? That there. That there. Back out. Keep the fire going. We're kind of waiting here till we get this all cooked up and we want our food to run out and then we can kind of start the food chain uh, and by food chain I don't mean what you eat like higher in the food chain I mean uh, both of these have 20 minute run times and this has 10 so I kind of want to do you know eat this eat this and then eat one of these and carry one of those so we can just stay now let's see Health 25, 30, 35, stamina 12, stamina 10, stamina 8. But you can see the, the strawberry, while it doesn't give you as much health, gives you way more stamina. Ooh, and the honey really gives you a chunk of stamina. But it has a 15 minute dura duration. Okay, interesting. Alright, so we've got plenty of flint. We're going to make another one of these. Oh, is this not? Oh. Do, do, do. See, I found that again. <laughs> I want to get another flint axe going. What do I got to do to upgrade this? Let's upgrade it. Let's get some of that. And we gotta be careful. But let's upgrade and see what happens when we upgrade. Oh, 
I gotta upgrade the workbench to level two. Okay. Not a hundred percent on how to do that. We're gonna, we're gonna take a take a nap. Go to go to daytime. Ooh. Interesting. So I had a dream. That's cool. So as you can see, it keeps track of days. I'm wondering if there's like a time limit to beat this game too. But we'll find out. I got a minute left on this food. Then we'll eat up and uh, start figuring out what we need to do. I think one of the things that seemed like we need to do was make a chopping block. Because it said something about a chopping block. Um, this is on their workbench improvement. So. Now, it looked like it needed some flint and some wood. Now, we, we can go chop some trees down and get some wood. Not a big deal. This guy wants to mess, so we'll mess. Okay. Did a lot of damage as I was falling, so I knocked out another one. Alright. After we get this stuff all chopped up, that's when we'll go uh, get the food started. Self, don't let, <laughs> don't let a tree fall on you. Ah, uh, okay. Well, that's realistic. I'll give it that. I should have known that, that that happens since the trees do damage to other trees when they fall. Uh, they probably do damage to your building as well. Um, but note to self, uh, don't don't let the trees fall on you. All right, there we go. So we got. Um, Sorry, that was pretty funny. So we got our food going now. Get our items back. Try not to let a tree fall on us again. Because now we know that is no good. And look, we can even get some berries so that when our berry timer runs out, we still have berries. Perfect. All right, now, there's another tree here, so. Or another log, we'll get this chopped up. All right, this guy seems to want some. He came from a decently far away place to come get me, so. Now there is a big ocean here and we can sail on boats and we can create one. Probably get the fishing stuff once I do that, but I don't know if I really want to explore that stuff yet, so. Get back here. Pick up stone. And let's see. Okay, so we can Shopping block seems to. Do you have to put it inside? That's. Okay, it needs to be placed near the. Uh... Hmm, okay. 
Seems like this needs to go near the workbench. So here we go. So we'll, we'll throw that here. Is that part of the workbench now? Okay, so we can make stuff now. That's cool. Some leather. Let's see. Yeah, it seems like it just sits next to it. Doesn't actually do anything. Unlocked fire arrows. Stag breaker. Oh, that's kind of cool. A lot of stuff, but still missing out on the uh, the pickaxe. Okay. Now we are two, so we can upgrade. Now I wonder what upgrading this does. Did repair it when we upgraded the kit, which is kind of nice. Now the flint axe, we need flint, which we have, and we need it. Some of the new stuff we learned. We learned leather tunic, so we need deer hide for that. And leather pants. Now we did get some deer hide, so let's make those. Get rid of this. Throw that in there for now. Let's go with that. Um, leather pants, leather tunic. Sure, why not? We got some armor now. We also learned leather helmet, which costs six as well, which is cool. So, a little bit stronger. We'll get get our leather going, and we need to we need to hunt some deer. That's what I'm learning. We're gonna keep hunting these deer. Oh, and speaking of that, we just spooked one. Must have heard me. Talking about hunting deer, spooked them. Now, did we learn anything new here? No. I didn't learn anything new here. Oh, that's a workbench improvement too. Okay. Cool. So all these are kind of like workbench improvements. hunt. Nice shot there. Nice, we're gonna need a little more flint. So, 
rocks. Stone and flint we're always going to be picking up. I don't know where that guy's stuff went. There's a deer over there. Here's another one of these type places. I wonder how many like places you can have. Oh, oh, okay. Hey man, not cool. This the one we read earlier it might be. No. Okay. The finest part of us is here. my chance to shoot a seagull. If anybody's ever grown up near the shore, you would understand why that really upsets me. There's nothing I would like to do more than shoot a seagull. says we can eat another bite, which means we can eat another one of them. I just wonder if this has a beehive too. No. Okay. Now we are running out of arrows and nice. I was gonna say our bow doesn't have a lot of shots left either. We gotta be cautious here. Pick some berries while they're here. There's a boar down there, so we'll go fight him. Oh, there's a couple boar. Nice. So it looks like like the trophies can be used for stuff. So we're gonna want to make sure we're trying to get those trophies too. Like, saw that like stag hammer or whatever it was. Um, if you get deer trophies, so we're definitely gonna want to continue to kill these deer, not just for the leather that you get from them, but for our, uh, the potential trophies that we can get from them as well. There's some more of those neck thingies over there, so we're gonna go kill them. Get some more food. And who knows, maybe there's trophies for these things too. I haven't got one yet, but that doesn't doesn't mean anything. Keep moving. Uh, 
spooked deer. So we usually get some deer that spawn in here. I wonder what happened. Yeah, go, him going in the water might be actually one of the better things for me. Because I think we can track him down in the water. Oop, oop, oop. I think you die when you run out of stamina, I've heard. Yeah, careful. Now we can. Now yeah, let's try it. This is just a long shot, but. Play is turning into evening anyway, which means it'll be a good time to go back to sleep. Or maybe it's just getting wet out. Maybe we just got a storm rolling in. Okay. I have a feeling this is fine here, but if you were out in the woods, or uh, yeah, not out in the woods, out in the water, that this would not be good for you. goes out when it rains too. I wonder if we could build like a little hovel over that. Probably could. So we can keep the fire going. Um, but we should have enough here to let's see keep picking this nonsense up. <laughs> Need this. Need to get rid of that. Leather here. Got some more trophies. Got some more resin. Okay. As far as this goes, craft another one of these, and we'll go with some leather pants. And we'll craft some more arrows. Got some other pants now. Got a new bow. Working on all of this stuff. Go flint here, then we got food. We gotta get cooked up. Okay. What I do wanna do is see if we can't build something over this. Let's see. Okay. And then. seem to have done the trick. This doesn't want to snap here, but I don't know if we can. There we go. There we go. And look, the fire is on now. So yeah, that, that works. Not the uh, prettiest, but it does the job. Even though it's raining, we're getting dry because we're standing next to the fire, too. Is 
your goal right now is get that helmet. Get fully geared up. <laughs> then we need to work on getting a tanning rack, I think. Next step. Maybe there is just no pickaxe in this, or I'll pick. Maybe stone isn't super important, so... You don't really need a pick. Although it seemed odd, because I would imagine at some point that we're going to have to gather metal and stuff. Not that I know where to gather the said stuff from, but I would imagine we will need that. So our health is going down, I'm wondering, is that just the food wearing out? Your health slowly goes down as the food wears out? Smoked. Oh, is it? Oh, maybe it's because I'm inhaling smoke or something? Hailing smoke seems to be bad. <laughs> it's really peculiar. There's like some stuff that are like kind of unrealistic here, but then there's like some really cool realism that a lot of other survival games don't have. Like, inhaling smoke is bad for you. So let me see, it says I'm running out of food. Oh, now it says I'm cold. Can I sleep? You are wet. Oh, you can't sleep when you're wet. But it won't let me build a fire in here. Let's see, do I have any options to build fire? Like a fire pit or anything yet? No. Or a fire pit, fireplace. So what we are working on right now is going to be so we're gonna need some more deer hides, some more flint, and 20 leather scraps. <clears throat> we might actually have to knock down one of these walls to uh, maybe extend this base a little bit. Alright, so we're gonna Eat one of these, eat one of these, eat one of these. Keep the berries along. Almost dry. Hopefully, we can sleep through this. Can. Hopefully when we wake up there's not a storm going on. storm has passed. Early morning. Perfect time to go deer hunting. There's a deer right there that we just spooked. Gotta remember that one spawns near me. I think there's usually a herd of deer. Hey, 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 hey. Gotta stop wasting arrows on those guys. Nothing deer wise yet.
Nothing. I thought usually there was some... Well, there's a deer over there. Let's go... Let's go grab him if we can. Got him. Also need to start killing a bunch of boar because we need like 20 of that hide too. That so much looked like a deer over there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's a boar. Let's go. Let's go get him. Got the scraps. Alright. Let's, let's take our shot here. Let's see if we can finally. Dang it. It's like they know that we're going to shoot at them. Yes, yeah, so that deer's still freaking out from earlier. guys. These guys get old quick, huh? You do get resin from them, so they're the only thing I've seen that you get resin from, so maybe it's good that we're killing a bunch of them. Let me get you, Seagull. No! <laughs> Damn Seagulls. I feel like Yoda. <laughs> uh, hopefully some of you. I'm sure most of you got that. the deer in the boar wasn't there like a probably lost a little bit I thought there was like a boar that stone there's a deer you idiot yeah okay that that's where the boar stone was I was hoping they would spawn back up there like crazy like they did that one time not so lucky should really try to avoid scaring all the deer they just blend in really well sometimes. Let's see over here. Got some berries. Like I said, we're gonna pick these whenever I find them. Just so we have the food and then I'm sure later on there's recipes that you can learn and cook with these. So here's another little opening over here. Doing a little exploring. Okay. Well, there's a boar over there. More of those little guys. Go fight the boar. Go fight these guys. Let's look at the map. 
map a little bit. Oh, it shows you where you died and what day it was. Huh, that's funny. Oh, there's another stone thing over there. Go check that out and check this boar out. And by check, I mean kill. He hit me. What is this? Ooh, learned how to. You are exposed. Learned how to make a cape. That's cool. Now, where was that? There it is over there. Let's see what this has to say. For an afterlife, this this place isn't too bad. I mean, obviously, it's not Valhalla where all Vikings aspire to go. But if you're going to be in some kind of purgatory, this place doesn't seem too bad. At least there's stuff to do. And I don't know that you're in purg purgatory. It's a weird little take on the lore, I guess, where you're, you've been chosen by Odin, but in order for Odin to be okay with you coming back into Valhalla, or before you get to Valhalla, you just gotta kill a couple, you know, monsters. <laughs> Alright, we got some more boars up here, so let's go get these killed. Sorry guys, my phone is blowing up in the background. Keep killing these things. I don't know, it seems like we're not getting anything from them. Ah, oh, we got a couple tails, but... Ah, damn. Come on. Damn it. Alright, let's go for this one. Ah, got him! Ha ha! Dirty seagull. Alright, we can eat another berry. Alright. I know, guys. Pretty boring episode. Sorry. Just seems like this is something. Ah. What's that? Dang it. Let's shoot this instead, then. Seems like, you know, I've read that this game can be really grindy. Um, and, you know, hey, let's be honest. It's a survival game. What survival game is a grindy? Um. And we're not really sure what we're supposed to be grinding right now, so kind of just winging it. So that's what we got going on right now. We're hoping to get, like I said, get that workbench upgraded again. Do that, we're gonna have to f kill a bunch of deer. Which, see in the distance, that looked like a deer, don't it? And it pops in. We're gonna have to kill a bunch of boar too, so. Cool with the amount of boar we're seeing, but obviously we. Man, we had that one patch of like four deer down there. Wish we could run into that again. 
Maybe that was like a one-time patch, just like, uh... Oh, here's a deer. Just like that one-time patch of boar we ran into. Gotta get the deer whenever we can. Well, we got two hide off of that one, that's nice. Now we do know one kind of spawns up here by our base too. So let's... Yeah, that's the same one. Try not to spook it. Sorry, yeah, I was just checking something here. Not about the game. I said I was getting a couple. My phone was getting blown up. I was just checking what that was about. Never know when it's going to be something important with the wifey. Oh, Alright, got another deer here. Nice. So it looks like the food never goes bad in this game, so that it doesn't appear like there's any oh, here's some deer. like there's any kind of like preserving bin or anything that you need. Of course, every time I say something like that, something changes, so. Leave me alone, man. I'm trying to kill this deer. Please. No, I'll kill you. Happy? This, are you okay now? been thoroughly killed, you happy, life can continue. Alright, got some good deer hide there. What was it I needed, like 10? I might already have that 10. I've got 9, but I only have 7. Man, I was killing boar left and right, but I only have 7 of the boar hide. I need 20. Keep making the rounds. It seems like the deer and the boar spawn up in here, so... The deer more on the wood side, the boar out here. Can we get two seagull kills in a row? No. Oh, just missed. They're a small target. That's why I like the deer. Deer are easy, because they're big. Got a wide range with them. thingies, but we'll kill them. Like I said, I don't know if there's any kind of, uh, I don't know what that pause was about there. I don't know if there's any, like, trophy for these guys, so we're gonna keep killing them. They seem to not be dropping stuff as much. Maybe it's because I've killed these particular ones a lot. Let's see. Can I get up to this before it flies away? No. There's some boar down here. So we'll get the, the kills on these guys real quick. See, that didn't even. Oh, it did. It dropped boar meat. I was gonna say, I didn't see it drop anything, but it didn't drop any of the leather. And neither did that. Oh, yes, that one did. Alright, we got a couple pieces there. Keep looking, we got more of these, these ugly things over here. Nothing. Those guys are being stingy. All they want is your tails, they're tasty. Your tails are tasty. And they got like really pads all over them. <laughs> Nothing again. Those things are being really stingy lately. Where 
are you, dear? Oh, I think I just saw one. I did. A little far away. Boom. guys seem to respawn at a pretty reasonable pace. Over here. Uh-oh. Eek. Hey, hey, hey. Where are you going? Don't run away. There's some more leather there. You gonna give me a tail? Things have gotten super stingy. Wonder how far you can level up stuff, because it doesn't seem like I've been leveling up the uh, the axe anymore. Let's see if I can. Like, what's your max level? So, 12. Well, it looks like it's probably 100. So. Getting to be nighttime, so we're gonna want to start heading back to the base. Don't want to run into any skeletons. Maybe get lucky and run into one more deer on the way. Ran into that big buck last time that we spooked. see any this time though. run out. Ah! Alright. Alright, so I guess that's going to be the, the big goal of this episode, is getting uh, let us take us too much longer to get on um, that workbench upgraded again, see what we can get once it's upgraded. Pause there for the world save. Let's get this out because I know there is a deer that likes to spawn up here. And just hopefully sneak around and not spook it. Just check this other spot real quick. There's a deer that likes to spawn over here too. So we'll just check this one spot real quick and see if it's here. And then we'll go back to the base and sleep through the night and hopefully everything shall spawn back. I don't see it. Okay. Let's get back. Well, I don't want to bore you guys with cooking. Like we could do some cooking. Yeah, I'm not going to bore you with the cooking. We'll do that uh, off screen or whatnot. So let's see what we got real quick. So we got seven of those. 
We've got the tin. A bunch of resin. Got some feathers now. Food wise, we can eat, eat, eat. Be okay. So we're at 11 and 14. So we need six more. Uh, boar, I believe, is where we're at. Let's see. Furniture, no, crafting. Yeah, six more leather scraps. And then, ah, gross. We need 15 flint, so we need three more flint as well. So let's go to sleep, see if we have any crazy dreams. time go back out hopefully get some more deer and more importantly now get some boar killed and then pick up some flint and get that crafted and then we can end this episode on a little successful note uh, it does seem like this game is pretty grindy every little thing is, a, is pretty grindy so far but you know that's part of the survival game genre nothing usually there's like at least a deer over here you guys know that at this point because you've seen me circle this spot like 18 times all right we should be able to pick up some flint and stuff over here though Heard something. Oh, there is a deer. And one of these. Because there's always one of these. Okay. Got him. Deer hunt there. Now I gotta find all this, all these boar. I think we've already read this one, but let's just make sure. Yeah. Looking for flint as well here, guys. Speaking of flint. a couple spots. Now this is one of the spots where there's usually a boar that's fallen, so that's unfortunate that there was no boar there. But this out. Is that a boar up here? Yeah. Perfect. Don't be stingy. Give us the leather scraps. There we go. Five more leather scraps. Let's see real quick. Yeah, it was over here was where there was a bunch of boar that spawned. So it seems like upgrading this stuff definitely uh, makes it last a little longer. Because the axe I've noticed seems to last longer. Maybe it's just because we're not chopping up wood and stuff, but. Also, probably helped if we made it just dedicated for chopping wood. And, um. 
got one of those actual axes built. Come on, boar. So this is where the boar had been spawning. meat we forgot. Ooh, and leather. Nice. So we missed those pieces. So that's nice that we got them. Uh, is that a boar up here? Maybe? Yep. Perfect. Got the scraps. Oh, look at you. Oop, we got a deer right here. Okay, we've got another deer. Not what we're looking for though, we're looking for these boar right now. The boar are the most important part of our hunt today. We're already a little bit over an hour. We're gonna keep going until we get this, this done. I think we're, what, three pieces away? So three more boar away. Ooh, we'd run into some more boar over here, but so far it does not seem to be the case. Go check that building out over there. Right, got another one of these guys. There's deer up there. Man, now we're finding deer everywhere. What? Oh, you. Little bastard. It's like, what hit me? What did you scare the deer away to? Rip. No, no, there's. Ooh, that's. That's the buck, too. Just right over top of him. Boom. Alright, cool. Let's go see what the old buck has for us. Nothing special. Let's hope to at least get a. Uh, trophy out of the buck, since they're the ones with the actual antlers. <laughs> Alright, well, let's go check this little uh, area out over here. It's another nice little place to build. Kind of the same Building profile. Let's see if there's any uh, chest in here. There is. Alright, we'll take this and this. We won't really. Well, might as well replace ours. Boar, where are you? And there's another leather scrap. Brings us to 18, so we only need two more. Looks like these guys were actually farming. Whatever was here. Up, oh, and there's another one of those. Kind of looks like burial sites. I don't know if that's what that's supposed to be, but there was a skeleton in that one, so check this out. Yeah. Last time we learned something. This time not so much. Now, what does it say when we're in here? It says something about being exposed. You are wet. Yes, we're aware. It says a little signpost and everything. It's the first, like, real village looking area that we found. If there's anything in this place. Ooh, another chest. Yeah, we'll take take both of those. Does this one have a door too or no? It does. 
this one, no chest. Okay. Well, it was at least worth looking at. Hey, got another boy too. Alright, we're gonna start heading back because we should at least come across one more on the way back. Let's read this. Don't know if we've seen this one. On this spot, a tree fell on my head, and I cursed the gods. Praise of them, that they might forgive my reckless words. <laughs> okay. Well, you're fortunate, man. When I had a tree fall on my head, I died. <laughs> so, I don't know what he's complaining about. Not only did he not die, but... The gods didn't outright smite him for cursing the gods, which sounds like something he was a little scared of. So that guy got really fortunate. Is it in here? Some more flint. Head him back. Another one of these. Always gonna shoot these deer when we can. Because at least early on, it seems like they're important for. Got some boar here, too. This should put us over. Yep. Seems like the deer are important for armor and stuff, the leather. It's definitely going to uh, kill deer whenever we see them. We should be also able, hopefully, to make our leather hat now, guys. Ooh, and it's getting dark. So it's perfect. Don't feel rested anymore. Now it's getting rainy out as well. Let's see. We're headed home. Keep our eye out for any deer. But other than that, we're just gonna head home. Ooh. As I say that, there goes deer, but we got another boar, so. I think that's the, uh, the buck I had scared last time, too. Berries here. No. I said we were going to go back to the house and do this. We are, but I also did say whenever I see berries, I'm going to pick them for at least now. I mean, yeah, we were getting some better foods, but. Dude, that thing's going to continue to psych me out every time I see it from the distance. It's just got like a perfect deer profile. Like, oh, look, a deer. All right, almost back to the house. Let's get this upgraded. Here we go. Home. All right. Now. Let's do it. This thing requires the flint. Well, I do have the flint. I just gotta get it. I can put this stuff down here. All right, let's do it again. And boom. Okay. Workbench level three. All right. What can we learn in workbench level three? Nothing new. Can we upgrade this stuff to level 3? We can. Okay. So at least we can upgrade. Our stuff. I don't know how we pick this up again. Can get a leather helmet. Alright, got a leather helmet now 
too. It's starting to look like a Viking. Let's see, yeah. All right. Let's see what we can put away here, guys. That's where we had the flint. Trophies. Got a lot of deer hide now. So that's good. Skeletal pieces here. This up. Fill that up. Still leaving five there. And uh, we're going to cook the rest of this stuff, but we're going to do that off screen. So there we go, guys. A little bit of a longer episode as we grind it out. Um, the chopping block and then the tanning rack to get our workbench to level three. Um, not sure how we learn the next step in this. Uh, just keep playing, I guess. Running over all this stuff. We're gonna just toss this stuff in the lake or something. I don't know. Um, but let's see, just to make sure we didn't unlock anything here we probably got to get that up to the next level honestly to unlock the next stuff should probably build a, a beehive too at some point here yeah haven't unlocked anything meaningful so with that guys that's where we're going to end this episode uh as always guys if you give me a like a thumbs up um you know subscribe to my channel that would really, really help my channel out. Um, right now we're making Tim Tim videos and Valheim videos. Valheim, again, however you want to say it. Um, so if you're into either of those games or interested in those games, make sure you're checking out my channel. We're going to probably be doing at least a weekly upload of each. Uh, if we can get, you know, some people giving, giving the old thumbs up and subscribing to the channel, uh, I'll probably be able to push out more content. So... Um, but at least, expect at least a video of each of those series every week. They'll probably each be about an hour long. Um, and uh, with that, guys, uh, I hope you guys all have a fantastic, wonderful day. And as always, thank you for watching.